Okay, I want to switch gears. An issue that plagues many relationships is jealousy. Ed and Liz, however, take jealousy issues to another level. Let's watch. Okay, so here we go. Drop your head just a little bit more. Nice, beautiful, nice. Um, it's a lot easier when um, your subject's beautiful. Jealousy. Well, that's kind of cute. Hello. Nice. You're going to hear the real story. I definitely story. came into this hoping that I was going to learn um, some techniques, but I'm definitely feeling like Ed is just showing off. I think it's possible that Ed does like photography because he does get to flirt with women. It looks like she has no neck. <laughs> no. You're the student. I'm training you. You didn't train me. The whole time you were training her. Damn. I don't feel like Ed's being a good partner right now. Oh. So I'm just out of here. Ed really pisses me off. So the party's kind of wrapping up, and I see a friend of Liz grab her by the arm. I know her. She's a lesbian, and this looks like uh, an emotional fight. I've got a relationship with her. Seriously? Oh, go f yourself. No, no, no. No, Baby. go have fun if that's what you're going to think. I want to marry you. I want to spend the rest of my life with you, but you're hiding something. And I'm going to find out. I'm going to find out about it. And the way that she was reacting to you was how a girlfriend would react to a girlfriend. Liz, are you there? <laughs> that right there is bull. I mean, it's major insecurities over here. Do you feel here. that he is jealous? Of course. Of course. You don't think, okay, so. I think they're both jealous. But I think she feeds off of him because he has a major insecurity. That photography like, session about, like, was for him to show me no, how yeah, to but, be a photographer. But Liz, but you, he didn't but Liz, show me Liz, one Liz, thing. Liz, you listen with two ears and you don't talk. The first thing you, you need to do is learn how to respect your fiance. No, it's not. Okay, you're, you're emotional. You're just being emotional. So listen, Liz, you, you, you're not coachable. You think you know everything. You're as jealous as I am, and I can prove it. This is a bull <laughs> Like, make no sense. We treated her horrible. Like, f up. And I want to go back to the engagement party. You had accused Liz of maybe being in a relationship with a woman that was at the party. Correct. And Liz was just shocked that you would accuse her of that. She was an ex-gay co-worker that wanted to get with Liz. And so she told, she me, told she, Ed one day she, no, when no, no, we were several in a times, restaurant, if, they if ever you broke can't up, treat her right, it's going to take a real woman to treat her right. And I would that, her. Oh, great. Right. And then that was, part of, ever that was part of the girls' night out, which you would always go. I thought you weren't jealous. You just finished uh, telling us um, No, but jealous. no, it's out of respect. Liz, do you think Ed has been seeing anybody else since you two separated, since you moved out? I don't know if he's been seeing anybody else, but I know he was on a dating app. How do you know? I got a screenshot through Instagram. She spies on me. I got a screenshot through Instagram that my mom found. How am I wow. gonna, how am I spying on you when it's an Asian dating website? Okay, so let's and back. you were on a dating? Okay, let's you back up. Let's, okay, dating website? again, when we got it was this a year and a half shot, old. my mom and I created an account, which was very hard to create an account. Which is kind of weird. You and your mom right. set up a fake account he to spy on me? He was on it an hour after I left his house. We checked again the next day, and he was active three hours prior to that. I want, I want to see the receipts. That was a year-and-a-half-old website. Liz, did you immediately make the connection between the fact that Ed's ex was Asian and him being on No, I've eating? ever since Ed and I were even just friends, I knew what type he liked. So, Ed, have you spoken to your ex fiance Rose? No. You haven't corresponded with her through text? I would have to go back and look. I may have said hello. We're, we're friends on Instagram. But you don't remember if you have been in any kind of text conversation with her recently? I may have. I don't, I don't remember. You may. How are you not? It's a yes or no. I don't know. I don't know if I was or not. Well, in an effort to lay everything out on the table, we want to welcome Ed's ex, Rose, to the conversation. Uh-oh. 
Connecting remotely from the Philippines, please welcome Rose. Hello. Hi there, good to see you again. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Um, hi, Liz. Hi. Hi, Rose. I don't know if she can see me. Hi, Ed. How are you? Uh, good. <laughs> Liz, is this the first time that you are meeting yeah. Rose? And you're yes. absolutely beautiful. Thank you. You're too. <laughs> So, Liz, how are you feeling seeing Rose up here now? Um, I'm okay, honestly. Was there anything that you wanted to ask her? I have a couple questions right now. Sure, okay, go ahead. Has Ed messaged you or spoken to you the last couple months? Yeah. always asking me for uh, FaceTime. You want to uh, video call with him to FaceTime. So Ed said that he didn't, hasn't spoken to you at all, and then now he's saying he can't remember if he spoke to you. I didn't. That's not true. Because he only messaged me and I have a um, screenshot Okay, well, we, we have that screenshot. So, this is what I wanted to read. Can you read that for us, please? Um, I hope all is well. You look amazing. She says, thanks. He says, I want to come to the Philippines again to see you if you're open. Wow. You just said that you were in communication with her. Liz, well, sit down. Jesus Did Christ. he not just say that he, he did. hasn't spoken to her? Did you say yes or no? Did you or did you not just say I have not spoken to her? Me no speak English. What the You know what? It's not something to joke about, Ed. It is, because she's, this is her. This is who Liz is. She's yeah. reading, the proof is in the pudding. She's reading a stupid text. Tell me about that text. Just said, Tell me what about that text. I have not spoken to her. See? You just lied hey, to Liz. everybody right here. Liz, what are you thinking right now? I am um, tired of all the lies and deflection and projection. Well, first of all, I'm not lying to Liz. Um, I'm not denying the fact that um, I was on a dating website a year and a half ago. I admitted that. I didn't remember if I had texted Rose or not, and Liz and I were broken up, but I... It not, seems I, like you're not doing anything When I tell Liz love. I love her, that doesn't mean I'm, I'm lying. You're with somebody for two years, you're, you broke up 10 times. I don't even know, honestly, if we were together or not. I but, can't even but, tell Ed, you that. You can Terrible rattle off every single thing that Liz has done, but when I ask you a simple question like, did you reach out to Rose? You but told I, me no three times that you didn't remember. I might have been mistaken. Rose, do you think that Ed is still interested in having a relationship with you? Sa tingin ko gusto niya, da ayaw niya kasi nasa isang relasyon siya ngayon. She's saying he's interested, but he's um, in in a relationship right now. I don't think I have any more respect. Let me have my ring back. Oh. Wow. Wow. Ooh. Wow. You're a f yo. I'm just gonna say it. He got caught. I just want to move on. Um, Liz, Ed, I, I'm not exactly sure what to say, and I don't know what the future of your relationship is, but I hope there's some healing down the line. Thanks so much. Okay.